The future of science is no longer male dominated, with women now being a part of major breakthroughs across several fields. In South Africa, it's not any different. A team of female researchers in the country have built the world's largest 3D printer. It's called the AeroSwift, and it's set to improve South Africa's competitiveness in the business of additive manufacturing. With well, that story, here, CGTN's Julie Shire on Grassroots. The AeroSwift project to build the world's largest 3D printer started back in 2009. Since 2016, a female-led team has conducted extensive research using titanium powder to produce airplane parts. We melt um, your powder according to a 3D uh, designed image that you would have had. And um, what the machine software does then is that it slices up that design into uh, layers really small layers, we use 50 microns, so it's quite small. And then what the machine then does is it builds each layer. The machine transforms any type of metal powder into durable parts. It could help boost South Africa's additive manufacturing industry and create jobs. So it's developing new skills, that's what uh, we're going to be able to be doing. And also stimulating new industries or new markets through you know, building the machine itself, whether we have a mani machine manufacturer or, you know, a supplier that just wants to procure the machine for their own parts production. 3D printing produces less environmental waste than conventional manufacturing. It will also save companies money and time by allowing multiple product lines at the same time. The laser power that we have allows us to build really fast. So with building really fast, then you're able to cut down a bit on your production costs where um, something might have taken you three days to manufacture, we can manufacture it in a day. The large size of the bed allows us then to print different parts um, and multiple parts um, instead of just one by one. It makes us very competitive because globally this is the only one of its size and it's attractive especially for the aerospace industry because for some parts they are looking at 3D printing large parts but one, they're always restricted by the size of the bits that are currently available now commercially. This innovation could position South Africa as a global leader in 3D printing. The Council for Scientific and Industrial Research says it's in talks with several original equipment manufacturers including Airbus to put the machine into full-scale production. Chilishara CGTN Johannesburg, South Africa.